I want to give you guys a trick, okay? Sword, pen, shield, sword, shield, sword, shield. If you're on Eastern University, you know all about the sword and shield. Two most important things you need to have in a meeting, whether it's face-to-face -face or on the phone. I like Sharpies because they can see what you're writing, okay? So it becomes a mini whiteboard. Let me give you another little trick, and this is not even in Easton University, okay? It's a little bonus. I always take this and I make a little box down here in the lower left, okay? And then as we're meeting, if Nigel says, I'm gonna get you the 42X report, okay? Four two, let's say it's a two four X report. Okay, two four X report. Perfect. Okay, and then uh, if you could get me a summary. Perfect. And um, oh, oh, I'll let you know what our pricing is from our current vendors. Every time I'm listening in the meeting, I'm separating this box into two segments and I'm writing things down. Then at the end of the meeting, I can actually show this to the client. You know, I don't have to be like, hey, look at what I'm saying. I just show it to them if we're in person. I say, cool, perfect, Nigel. Hey, so based on my understanding, uh, homework, you're gonna get me the 24X report and the pricing. I'm gonna get you a copy of our schedule. I'm gonna write an email summary, and then I will have those three references for you. I'll get everything to you by 5 p.m. today. When were you thinking you could get me the 24X report and the pricing? Well, I'll have that to you this afternoon as well. Perfect. Awesome. So, and then I just recap it right back. You're going to get me the 24X report and the pricing. I'm going to have the uh, schedule to you, the summary, and the three references. Both of us will get those to each other this afternoon. Fair enough? Yeah. And all I did is it's like, man, look at how organized that person is, right? And then the other cool thing is I get in the car, like you said, after the meeting, I know exactly who's gonna do what, when they're gonna do it, and I can use those two super sexy words. They're the two sexiest words. Are they Brad Pitt? No, the two sexiest words in sales are not Brad Pitt, okay? They're not Angelina Jolie. They're as promised, okay? If you wanna be the Brad Pitt or Angelina Jolie of sales, put yourself in a position to be able to say, hey, um, Nigel, as promised, I've got, a, I've attached a copy of the um, scheduling, the summary we needed, and then I've put a link to the three references. Then you get asked the two million dollar questions. Does that match what you needed? Did I miss on, did I miss anything, right? And it becomes so easy. Everything flows so perfectly.